Hello, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna show you how to select rows and columns in R. So right now we are in the R Studio environment, and I have prepared the code here for you. Um, first of all, let's run the first two lines to get the data. This is a very simple data with height, weight, and age. So after you select these two rows, and then you click run and then you will get a data set it's a um, data frame format with three columns height weight and age um, you can close it so first command is you select all the rows and all the columns you just call bracket uh, blank comma blank so meaning you will select every element from all the rows and every element of all the columns basically everything from the data set you set up so after you click this command um, it will show you the complete data set here in the console now the second one if you just want to have the first row the 183 175 and 178 Oh, this is kind of insane, like nobody can live up to 178. Um, but anyway, probably this is in days. Uh, so if you want to choose the first row and everything from all the three columns, you do a bracket one comma blank. So that is the first row with all the columns. Let's run this. Now you get just this vector of the first row. Um, so similarly, if you want to select first two rows, you will do bracket one uh, column two. So meaning first two rows and then everything from the column. So you leave it blank, meaning you will select all the columns. So you will get these two first two rows. Okay, so what if you wanted to choose the first and the third row and skip the second one? you will do a concatenation with a C bracket 1 and a 3. So then you, you will skip the second row and also everything from the column. Now you get the first and the third column. Um, okay, so now we can do some operations on the columns. If you want to choose first row and also the second column and the third column, you can do uh, bracket one comma two colon three so this will give you the first row and also the last two columns see so now you only have weight and age show up with the first row and next one we will have first and second row and also second and third column so this will be an easy task for you so let's do a check. We got the first two rows correct and the last two columns. Nice. And now you, you want to get the first column with all the rows. You just do bracket blank everything uh, from the rows and the first column. So this will give you a vector 183, 85, 40, but they put it in a row. Actually, this is the first column you selected. 183, 85, and 40 for all the heights. Um, and then if you want to select um, the first and third column with every row, so then you will show height and age with all the rows with this command height and age with all the rows. Yeah, I hope you learned something from this short video and thank you for watching. Bye-bye.